my pleasure as the Group Vice Chancellor to host this uh, International Symposium on Sustainability and Disaster Risk Reduction in Architecture. And I welcome you all uh, to the Institute for Art and Culture. I would like to especially thank the chief guests, uh, architect Arif Chagrizi Sahib, Chairman PKP, and Begum Sir, but actually she will be here very soon. Uh, I also welcome our esteemed guests and speakers over here. I am also honored to welcome all the students, the architects, the professors, the faculty uh, from various institutions, uh, institutions who have joined us today. Ladies and gentlemen, the global challenges call for a new understanding of growth and responsibility. We are, for example, confronted with major uh, resource constraints at this moment because of uncontrolled exploitation of resources of our mother earth. The continuous growth in population and economic growth and exploitation of resources has resulted into climate change in Pakistan. Now, Pakistan actually is one of the 11 countries who is at risk from climate change at this moment. Now, if we allow this process of exploitation, it would lead to more changes in the environment, like leading to floods, for example, or deforestation, or glaciers, or uh, food shortages. So it is very important at this stage to ask the questions, uh, relevant questions related to the climate change, which is, did we choose the right instruments in the, in the face of this crisis? Uh, have, we, uh, have our recovery programs had the intended effect? And most importantly, how can we secure lasting and sustainable economic growth? Now, uh, the global challenge actually requires the transnational and transinstitutional approach. Uh, IAC actually, under the like you know uh, uh, guidance of our Chancellor IAC, has taken one step in this direction. Uh, we are like planning to uh, have an MOU today that would be between. Uh, Institute for Art and Culture, Lahore College for Women University, uh, Disaster Risk Management Unit Philippines, uh, our guest is over here, and Provincial Disaster Risk Management Authority. This would be actually one of our IEC's contributions towards this nation uh, to support the process of awareness in climate change. We hope that today's discussion would be very fruitful to uh, all of you and we'll have a very uh, uh, you can say uh, stimulating discussion and our speakers would enlighten us with their knowledge. Uh, thank you very much and again I welcome you all.